The head of Georgia's Central Electoral Commission was doused with black paint Saturday at a meeting to confirm the results of the country's divisive October 26 parliamentary elections. Protesters gathered outside the commission's building in Tbilisi, where officials announced that the ruling Georgian Dream Party had won 53.93% of the vote. Opposition supporters have rejected the results amid allegations that the vote was rigged, an accusation that Georgian Dream denies. The Saturday session was interrupted when David Kurtadza, a commission member from the opposition United National Movement Party, threw black paint at Commission Chairman Georgi Kalandarishvili. Before the incident, Kurtadza told Kalandarishvili that the official results of the vote did not reflect voters' true choice. Kalandarishvili responded by saying that the use of pressure, bullying and personal insults proved that there was no evidence of vote rigging. When the meeting resumed, Kalandarishvili was seen with a bandaged eye. It once again becomes evident that in reality there is no tangible proof that indicates that the elections were manipulated, he told the session. European election observers have described the Georgian parliamentary elections as taking place in a divisive atmosphere marked by instances of bribery, double voting and physical violence. Many Georgians viewed the vote as a pivotal referendum on the country's effort to join the European Union. The bloc suspended Georgia's membership application process indefinitely in June after the country's parliament passed a foreign influence law that critics say mimics Moscow's crackdown on civil society. Italian Nishnolovani da historiuli archevne bi kochweni ko ekonis tu isam tu xarot im gamot evas Europa suha central masar archevno komisiam tu eni chemtuane lobit Robel Sats es dam sa xure bulat Europis kenunat zave ko anet da dres tu eni chemtuane lobit tu eni ushualot chartu lobit tu eni usamart lo gadat tu eti lebebit tu eni ko ekana Rusetis ken mi ekane ba dres tu eni gideut zin parat ina purceli es avit kodi. Romelitz real urat, cheni amom cheulis ne basara sa chaos. Assetik medebit, asseti zets olit, asseti bullyingit had, asseti iradit how das mebit, pacto brivat kidevert held hadas tur daisrom, real urat, archev neptan da kaushirebit, arar sebos, raime, helshe sahebi, karemoeba, romels mutitebda imazerom, archev nebi romani polirebuli. Krasnish, erti sahema, granu esse gaiet, it was animal opposition. Police and demonstrators clashed outside the parliament building of the Georgian separatist region of Abkhazia as tensions flared over a proposed pact that would allow Russians to buy property in the region. Most of Abkhazia broke away from Georgia in fighting that ended in 1993, and Georgia lost control of the rest of the territory in the short war with Russia in 2008. Russia recognizes Abkhazia as an independent country but many Abkhazians are concerned that the region of about 245,000 people is just a client state of Moscow. Hundreds of protesters gathered at the fence outside the parliament, which was to consider ratification of the agreement under which Russians could buy apartments in Abkhazia, whose mountains and Black Sea beaches are popular with Russian tourists. Opponents say the agreement would drive up property prices and boost Russian dominance of the region. The parliament session was later postponed, but protesters remained at the fence, then used a truck to break through. Police blocked them from entering the building as the protesters threw rocks and eggs, then tried to push them out of the territory and fired tear gas, according to Russian and Georgian news reports. There were no immediate reports of arrests or injuries. 
The arrest of five opposition figures at a similar demonstration on Monday set off wide protests the next day in which bridges leading to the regional capital of Sukhumi were blocked. Долой президента! Отставку президента! Отставку президента! Но помимо того, что мы требуем отставки президента, мы требуем от парламента ввести мораторий на соглашение и на закон об апартаментах. Два моратория сегодня, если не будет здесь у нашего народа и не будет отставки президента, я думаю, что вы не должны уходить с этой площади. Я спущу сама спокойно. Turkish police have detained a suspect who discharged a shotgun into the air in an area close to the Israeli consulate in Istanbul, Turkey's state-run news agency reported. The suspect, who was not identified, fired five or six shots into the air as he arrived in the area late on Thursday, Anadolu agency said. Several police teams were dispatched to the area, and the suspect was detained during an operation conducted by special operations police, according to the report. It was not clear if anyone was in the building. Israel had pulled out its diplomats from Turkey due to security concerns. Turkey has emerged as one of the most vocal critics of Israel's military actions in Gaza. Yeah. <laughs>